Work is now complete in Rancho Cordova, built brick by brick. Yes, Julissa Ortiz is at Mills Middle School with the finished product and the creators. Hi, who? Hey, good morning to you. Yes, Mills Middle School, the students there, they created this amazing portrait using Lego, and it is now here on display at the MAC, which we love coming to check out the Mills Station Arts, Cultural Cent Culture, and Center. And are you guys ready? Drum roll. Ta da! There it wow. is. Oh, that turned Look out at great. That. Didn't it turn out amazing? When we were there, they were maybe about halfway through, right? And it's, of course, Mills Middle School. So I've got two of my friends here, Cheryl, of course, with the Mac, which we love to visit. And, of course, the teacher, amazing teacher, reason number 795 million why we love teachers, is Ms. <laughs> Bird right here, the one who came up with this project. How amazing. This turned out so fantastic. It really did. I'm really happy to see it. And um, the kids are very proud of their work and, oh, and really excited to be a part of something like this. That is so awesome. This this was something, you know, you were just looking for uh, something fun and different for them to get engaged yeah. and learn about people like Malala. Yeah, it really exploded into something bigger than I anticipated. I just was looking for something for my students to do and when they finish their work early. Yeah. And um, I'm really excited about how it turned into something bigger about learning about her and yeah. learning about what she stands for. Mm -hmm. And so it's created a lot of extra discussions in my class like that. That, that I hadn't planned for. So. Right, right. Uh, and this was not the first one. You also worked on a Lego uh, project, that uh, a portrait of Martin Luther King Jr. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we did that one um, a couple years ago. Mm -hmm. And same thing, we just kind of were looking for something to do. And I had found the plans on a teacher pay teacher yeah. site. And so we did it. And it was such a success that we decided to try another one. And then for this one, I let the students pick who they wanted to do. Yeah. So we came up with that idea. So fantastic. That Martin Luther King Jr. one was sold. This one will also go on the auction right coming up so you have a chance to see it here at the mac i want to bring in cheryl so how amazing right i know you love this seeing oh. kids do art that's kind of your thing it is <laughs> such my thing i am all for art in schools yeah. it teaches them so much but the way that uh stephanie bird has organized the kids and how they have to think about who it is they're doing and yeah. why they're doing it and then map out work together there's just so many components mm -hmm that it's, it's just fabulous to see. And it's um, an amazing yeah. piece of art. Absolutely. I would love to have that on my wall. I, I, I would too. All right, it's here at the MAC for now, yeah. but it could end up in someone's home on their wall. Yes, because we want to keep perpetuating what Stephanie has started with the teaching of the kids mm -hmm. and the Lego project. And so this will start at $300 during our members show in June. Okay. And we are looking to raise some more money because as most parents know, Legos are incredibly <laughs> expensive, but they're super cool. Yes. So, and this is more, um, instead of buying a kit, this is really teaching them mm -hmm. way beyond that capacity. Absolutely. Absolutely. All right. So we're going to be back before that auction begins in June to remind you that this could be yours. In the meantime, Ms. Bird, are you guys working on another one? What, what, what has, have your students yeah. chosen? Well, we, um, they have a few lined up that they're interested in. You know, they like doing some, um, um, you know, uh, cultural icons mm -hmm. and things like that. But um, I'm hoping to do our school mascot and have one that stays in my room because we miss these when they go <laughs> away. So I'd like to keep one for display for my classroom. Yeah, Mustang for okay. us. And are you need, are in need of Lego? Always in need of Legos. Right. Yes, yes. Any donations. Um, we love them, and uh, especially the more classic type Legos. Um, we can use them. We can take them anytime. I'm happy to come pick them up. Find my email on the okay. Mills Middle School website, and I'll and I'll come grab them or drop them off at our oh, school. Sounds good. All right. I know my kids aren't watching this morning, so <laughs> I definitely have a few <laughs> that I'm willing to donate. <laughs> a few that I have stepped on more than once. Yep. All right. Absolutely amazing. Thank you both so much. So cool to see this all complete. Love what she's doing. I'll send it back over. To what you. if we start a campaign? If you step on a Lego, it immediately gets volunteered to the school. I love it. Yep. I love it. Everybody so across Northern all? California. So, so say, say we all. <laughs> All across Northern California, if you step on a Lego, that means it's the schools from there. No. It's going to yeah. the Mac. Yeah. I love it. I like it. <laughs> Thanks, Hoop.